progressives think they know better than you do. They want to control every aspect of your life. I didn't know that that's what I wanted, but I guess I want to control every aspect of your life. It turns out that progressives advocating for government regulations on toxins in water and our children's toys turns us into China. In the 48 hours since the Romney video first gained wide exposure, turd containment crews have been working overtime on Bulls <laughs> Mountain. Keep in mind it was posted by a left-wing website. Mother, jo Mother Jones, by the way, put this tape out. Mother Jones, the magazine no one reads. Yeah. Even word that Jimmy Carter's grandson might have played an instrumental role in getting this video. Oh my God, your campaign got blown up by Jimmy Carter's grandson? <laughs> Reconcile the brilliance and knowledge that you have of the intricacies of the market with the crazy bull I see you do every night. There's a market for it, and you give it to them, and I think There's we a do market for cocaine and hookers. Well Good evening, and uh, welcome to The Daily Show. Uh, we are back. Uh, this is our first show since uh, the tragedy. They said to get back to work. And... Uh, uh, there were no jobs available for uh, a man in the fetal position under his desk crying, uh, which I gladly would have taken. The main reason that, that I wanted to, to speak tonight is, is uh, not to tell you what this show's gonna be, not to tell you uh, uh, about all the incredibly brave people that are here in New York and in Washington and, and around the country, uh, but, but We've had an unenduring pain here, and, and unendurable pain. And I just, I wanted to tell you why I grieve. But why I don't despair. And they attacked it. This symbol of American ingenuity and strength and, and labor and imagination and commerce and it is gone. But you know what the view is now? The Statue of Liberty. The view from the south of Manhattan is now the Statue of Liberty. You can't beat that. We have a gentleman who can face off with President Bush in a spirited debate. So first, we'd like to welcome to the program the President of the United States, George W. Bush. Sir? Thanks for the warm welcome. It's good to be here. Uh, sir, uh, no, nobody actually clapped, but... but... <laughs> and to debate uh, President Bush, a much more popular figure, first term, President George W. Bush. Good evening. I'm pleased to take your questions tonight. Wonderful news.